Um, well, I mean, you have to you have to assert absolute morality. You see, I, I don't necessarily marine, because you can't you can't say that. That's too it's way too broad. You, you can't you can't say that because God tells people to kill people in the Bible. You know. Do he tell people today to kill? People? No, but but he, I do mean, he, it, it won't find he did. Yes, we do. But that's, I mean, animals kill each other. No, no, but no, you, no, no, you have, about you're animals. Yeah, we're talking about humans. And then when, you, you can't, when you God, can't, you can't. Well, I must say this, when God told ones to kill ones, because he's a righteous judge. But he's, you a, can't, he's the source of life. I don't believe he had, you, already, he had already judged these you ones. You can't assert absolute morality, because by that aspect, if, some, if somebody breaks into your home and they're harming your family, and you don't, you, you, you're neglecting, an ob if you don't kill that person, you're let's neglecting say, an obligation let's, let's say, as a man. Let's take you know? it to war. Right? He's killing people in the war. Well, I, I, I mean, if, if you if you thinking as like Vietnam when we were slashing, no, I, I, I'm totally against that. I'm, I'm more of a liberal type of person. I, I don't think war is necessary. But you take Al-Qaeda. We can't just let them run free. Sometimes okay. we well, have to go in and we have to kill people I ran, to defend ourselves. I ran through the jungle for 29 months. All right. You know. Okay. Well, that to the, to this day I still suffer from that. Yeah, and and it's. I don't care if you shoot a person, if a person, if you drown a person, a person still it's just as dead. But you have to protect yourself. You know, and I'm not saying it's it's always justified because what you know, what presidents are doing to other presidents, of a, they have agendas that they're asserting. But I'm talking about when it literally comes down to protecting yourself, like with Al Qaeda and, and the the war to jihadists, when they're crashing planes into us. You know what what George Bush did, and I, I don't think you know weapons of mass destruction. We, we should have been over there hurting all those people, but. Sometimes you have to, to kill to defend yourself. The reason why I'm saying that, and that is if all of us would live by this, then we wouldn't have that problem. I said all of us, I mean, I'm not talking about just us sitting in this room. Yeah. This is what we live by. This right here protects us from being just as barbaric in many instances. I, I see, you're, but what you're claiming is that you need this we do. to be a moral good person. That's not to say that everybody, that, that there are people who, who don't need it, because I, I can see people that, like atheists and stuff, and, and they're kind to other people, they're, they're productive in society, they're, they're kind to animals. Um, Richard Dawkins, I'm a very, very good fan of, he's, he's a, a, um, an announced atheist, and he's a very kind, loving person. You know, he donates to charity. I don't see anything that, that he should be condemned for. Well, but see, by the, by the Bible, he should be. Well, just because what he believes. Well, and you can't control what you No, believe. no, understand this, what I'm saying. See, it's not our job to condemn anyone. We don't condemn nobody. But, 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 yeah, but see, taking, the I'm Bible good. would say that Richard Dawkins isn't living, he's not living scripturally. He, he's not. So then what, who would be wrong? Me or Richard, uh, Richard Dawkins, if I follow this right here, that, that, it that's not to say that, that you're wrong or, or you're bad. That, that's, don't, that's not what I'm trying to say. What I'm saying is that using him, for example, he doesn't need this. He, he's able to do it without it. So I, I don't believe that that every that that's you know everybody if everybody if we don't believe in the Bible that that's going to be the destruction of the earth because I can see him doing it without it and that, that's saying well, where, that, did, where did he get that from? But because you're saying that's, that if this is what he's doing, these are principles of the Bible. But you claim you that you that, need you this. Get to, that, you get that from someplace. You claim yeah. that you need this to be a good person. He's not using yeah. that to be a good. But person. He's using a principle. No, he, where do you get that? He have to be. Yeah, he's using the to principle. To be given a charity, that's not that's not normal. What about what about tribes of baboons that use some of the principles, or tribes by, uh, tribes of bonobo monkeys that use some of the principles? Because of what that says, that humankind is created in God's image, so we have His attributes of being loving. That's an attribute that we have. 
wanting justice. But see, I, I think those lo- are I all think divine. We, we discussed this before. I think love is beneficial to surviving of a species. We've observed love in animals. The same chemicals that release in our brain that, that causes love, we can demonstrate that in the animal brain. So. And, and we, we've observed how that's helped, you know, a few species in particular evolve and survive. So I believe love is just, it's just chemical reactions. It's, it's a beneficial thing in nature. It's a beneficial adaptation. Say animals love? Or yes. is that instinct? No, it's not instinct. The bonobo monkeys, the, the females rule the whole tribe. They control the tribe with sex. They're completely non-passive. They don't hurt each other. And when they have sex, you can watch the videos. It's not like regular animal sex. They have sex front ways, back, all different positions. They get up and hold hands and, and want to try to get out of bed and she'll jerk them back and they'll cuddle and they, they love each other. And when, when you could separate them, put a different, a different, monk, uh, a different chimp over there and that, that chimp will, will, won't like that chimp and will miss the other chimp. That, that's the same thing that we're experiencing. And we've observed that. The same, we've observed the same chemicals under CAT scan showing images of, of a, a woman, you know, a woman's husband that she's been with for a long time. And, and watching the, the chemicals and the active parts of the brain through, through technology. And then we've observed the same exact thing in animals. So it's, it's a... Uh, Wouldn't that chemical... And the brain be basically the same with it's with dopamine, with uh, what, What's that? Wouldn't that the chemicals in the brain of an um, of an animal? We we have the same chemicals: yeah, adrenaline, that's why, yeah, that's a dopamine, yeah. epinephrine. Mm-hmm. We we have all the same chemicals. Yeah. But you know, like I said, you know, I understand what you're saying, and like I said, it's a matter of research and, like you said, belief. But it's yeah. it's not you're intertwining too. Research would indicate you're going by evidence, and belief would indicate that you're going by faith, which is separate from evidence. What I'm saying is is everything I, I'm saying is reference. I can you can you can demonstrate the evidence. Well, the point that is, that is completely different from faith. Is it? Isn't it true that uh, was it Darwin? There was Darwin. Saying, yeah, yeah, Charles well, Darwin. Yeah, didn't he? did he have something the way that? Was, the origin tell, of species? Yeah. Uh, you, the reason something, an animal had a short tail, because it was some, I, I, I'll find it, I'll bring it to you. Well, but it, it's something that was so outlandish. But that, that, that doesn't mean that he, his, whole, his whole thing is wrong, by any means. He, he's a scientist. What scientists do, the way science works, is they have a problem. Right. They throw speculations at it. And until that speculation in particular is proved wrong, you can't say that that, that didn't happen. And that's how it works. So, of course, he's going to have theories that were disproved. Every scientist has theory. If, if a scientist didn't have a theory that he proposed that wasn't true, he wouldn't be oh, a scientist. that's true. But guess what? Yeah, but, this, we, we have, but we have demonstrable evidence that... that, that pr- Would that, you agree on that? That what? nothing in here has not been proven? No, the ark hasn't been proven. How is the ark been proven? What do you mean, how? how I mean, how, how, the, the story okay, of knowing well, the ark, okay, how is that been proven? Let me put it like this. Um, there have been situations in the Bible. You remember the founding of um, Babylon? 